Behind me is a beautiful Venice. And as you can tell, there is a storm coming in and I am staying on Guideca. I hope I'm pronouncing it right. And today we are making one of the most popular drinks in Italy, a beautiful Aperol Spritz. My name is Aliena and welcome to Venice. So to start making our Aperol Spritz, I just have my glass and I filled it up with some ice and then I also added an orange slice to it. And to that, I'm going to be adding in two ounces of my Aperol. This is a very full two ounces right here. There we go. And this is what creates such a lovely color of our drink. So now I'm adding in two ounces of soda water. And last but certainly not least is our champagne or you can use Prosecco. I like to add anywhere from three ounces, that's more traditional. But if you like a sweeter drink, you can add a little bit more, which is usually what I do because I like it to be a little bit sweeter. So I will take my Prosecco. <laughs> and here we have our delicious Aperol Spritz. This is one of my favorite drinks in Italy because it's just so refreshing. I personally like having it on a little bit of a hotter day than today, but it's still going to be so tasty. And now it's my favorite time giving it a try. Wow, that is so good and so clean and so crisp. And it's a little bit sweeter because I added a little bit more champagne to it. To it. <laughs> Cannot speak. This is my second one. We've been drinking all day. No, I'm not going to say that. And this is absolutely delicious. It's so refreshing. It's so clean tasting. And I love that little bit of bitterness that the Aperol gives. So please let me know if you like this video and what you think in the comments down below. Also, if you want to see more of my traveling cocktail recipes, there should be a playlist right here or over here. Thank you so much for watching and I hope to see you next week. Cheers.